Might it be possible to design a mid-size sedan so attractive, so dynamic, and so generally compelling that it at least slows the sales exodus from sedans to crossovers? Probably not, but wow, Honda sure is giving it the old college try with its 10th gen Accord. The design is cleaner and more upscale inside and out, the mainstream engines are both turbocharged, and each can be had with your choice of a sporty 6-speed manual transmission or a paddle-shifted automatic. And get this, not only is the bigger engine adapted from the hot hatch boil racer Civic Type R, but when paired with the spanking new 10-speed automatic the sedan's also quicker to 60 miles per hour than the Type R? You dare not bait a spoiler and wing Type R at the stoplight in your CRV or pilot. Okay, don't bait a Type R in your Accord either, because you'll be eating its dust shortly after 60 miles per hour. It's only the automatic seamless shifts that briefly put the sedan ahead of the lighter, more powerful row your own Type R. The design target for the new 2.0-liter turbo was to meet the V6 Accord's performance while exceeding its fuel economy, and by R and EPA's measurements the team appears to have hit the bullseye. Our 2.0T Touring model's 5.7 seconds 060 mph time precisely matches that of our last V6 Touring, which weighed 175 pounds more. That figure also happens to match the Chevy Malibu 2.0T Premier, besting the new Camry XS EV6 and Civic Type R by a tenth. At the quarter mile mark, the new car is a tenth behind its V6 progenitor but is traveling 0.7 miles per hour faster, and its braking and lateral grip figures are identical at 116 feet from 60 miles per hour and 0.85 grams. A 0.3 second deficit in figure 8 time. At identical average G, probably has more to do with the different test surfaces than actual performance. As for fuel economy, preliminary figures peg the new car's EPA City Highway figures at 23-34 mpg versus the V6's 21-33.